Alright, what's going on Forgotten Nation? I'm your host, FG, and welcome back to some more Runner 3. And we are in Spooky Land, ready for the gem run. But for those that have been watching the gold run, oh my gosh, this game is difficult! This game's already getting hard! There's only three worlds, and the halfway point's already impossible. And that's just the gold run. So what awaits us in the gem run? I feel like it's only gonna be harder. No telling what awaits, let's just go straight into the game. Oh my gosh, they weren't kidding when they said Runner 3 was much harder than Runner 2. You could almost say it's impossible. And these aren't even the challenge stages, these are the main game stages. What were they thinking? Oh my gosh. Alright, then mind though we're ready for the gem run, so let's revisit stage 2-1. Let's go back to the piers that remind me of Emerald Brine. And maybe we might have to fight that octopus anymore. Maybe he's just out of the picture in this gem route. Now remember, with the gem routes, gold is not the necessity, only the gems. And we will be trying to start the hero quest to initiate upon trying to go for the completion and collection items that is the next run. Alright. It definitely wants to favor the high route for these gems. Alright, so now we're taking the gem routes. I don't know, so I'm gonna feel easier. Eh, yeah, to an extent. Ah, uh, it's that camera angle again. I do not like that ca forward camera angle. Alright, but here we are again. We're gonna ignore the checkpoint, because always say no to checkpoints, but I do remember what's coming up ahead. Luckily, we don't have to focus on the gold anymore, but it did help to figure out where to avoid the upcoming enemies. But, can we get to it? Yep, here we go. So, don't focus on the gold, but it will be a good assistance to staying alive. Okay. And here comes... Okay, okay, we're doing it. Alright, there's still five more gems, though, that we gotta go for. Alright, there they are. Okay, we got one more out. Alright, alright. That was actually much easier than the gold route, surprisingly. I don't know how, but that was easier. How was that easier? Alright, alright. Let's just continue. That's the first stage, so now we're on to the second stage. Alright. Maybe it'll actually be easy. Maybe the gem route is, in disguise, the easier route to take. Or these, uh... These creators just hate the completionist. I don't know. Alright, but here we go. Second stage, gem route. We can do this. I've endured suffering already with the gold run, so hopefully the gem run isn't much harder. Because we are taking different paths, so therefore, we're not taking the same paths that made me angry. Just as long as we don't run into those armored knights. I despised the armored knights. Alright. Hmm. Alright, nothing major up there. So I do wonder what the point of that was. Unless it's for one of the collectibles for the hero routes. I don't know, I'll have to wait and see. So the first stages really do represent what Spooky Land is, but the later stages, I don't know what they were going for. It's confusing how it suddenly takes a big turn towards the books, the uh, the judges, and really just the letters. So I'm a little confused on what Spooky Land was meant to be. I don't know. Alright. 
Okay, here comes the gems. So we're gonna take the higher out this time. Oh, and we got the puppets! No to the checkpoints. I'm lost in thoughts. Alright. Take that. Oh! Okay, so I gotta fall where the, the gold is to fall into the gem. So don't fall right away, because otherwise you're not gonna have enough time to jump back up. Alright, let's get back to it. But we did get the puppet, so thankfully we don't have to grab that no more. For, uh, for better or worst. Or you could say, for cheddar or worst! <laughs> ah, food land puns, even though we're in spooky land. People are ringing my doorbell. Uh, let's see what that's about. All right, pretend that didn't happen. Let's go back to the game. Alright, here we go again with the gems. Alright, say no to checkpoints. Alright, alright, let's do it, let's do it! Alright, so fall down here, jump, there we go. Now we're doing it. Oh, I got lucky. Okay, that was pure luck. Okay, so take the high route, got the gems. Alright, here comes this, oh, we got the fast section. And I had to stay low. No! I wanted to use the bounce pad so bad. Alright, let's just focus on what's going on. I'm kind of wondering what's the point of the trampoline doesn't up there, unless it is for the hero quest. I don't know. Alright, we just gotta get back to the gem route. Come on, we're almost there. Alright. I really do want to know the story that's going on here in Spooky Land. Why would Simple Talk come here, honestly? Doesn't seem like there's much to offer. It's like a worse version of the Supernature. But that's just my opinion. Because with the Supernature, there's just so much more vibrant life. But here, it seems like everything's in a state of decay. And I guess that maybe works for Spooky Land, but... Again, the later half doesn't really feel very spooky. Alright. Alright, here we go again with the fast section. So don't take that. And I still missed it! Alright, alright. Let's do it. Let's do it again. We can do it. Whoa, that was weird. Kick it down. Whoa, what? I jumped. That was not fair. That was anything but fair. Alright. Kick 
Kick it down. What am I doing wrong? I'm jumping on the platform. Why? Okay, uh, I skipped the gold, doesn't matter. We don't need the gold. Alright. Alright, be careful. Slam on that. Alright, here we go. We got some more gems. Got the gems. Awesome. Careful. Say no to checkpoints. Alright, got some gems. Get ready for this. Hi, there we go. We got the gems. All right, comes the fast segment again. So we got to time this just right. There we go. Okay, okay, keep going, keep going. Automated, awesome. Make it easy for me. All right, that's all 25. So now, yes, we made it to the end. Okay, that wasn't all the gold, but still, that was good. That was good. It got intense in the speedy section, but at least we did it. And because we got the collectible, unless we have to go there again for one of the hero items, which even then won't be for a long time because we just grabbed and quit, it's still going to be a challenge. But, okay. So, let's continue with... The Gibbering Cliff. Alright. I swear, this game only gets more intense. Alright, so what's it gonna offer me? Let's wait for it. Alright, here we go. Alright, so stick to the high route. Whoa. Ah, oh, I should have slammed down that. Whoa! I almost missed. Alright, remember to kick it down. Okay, I remember the stage wasn't really too bad. It was one of the easier ones. But I wonder how it's gonna offer with the gem route. Right, this was the stage that was going in reverse. Uh, I say no to checkpoints, but maybe we should have got that. So then, okay, here we go with the gems. Uh, conveniently easy. Whoa, okay, that's, whoops. I take back my word, I was about to say conveniently easy, but never mind. Even though small stuff like that was enough to kill me. Ah, the gold. All right. Give all. Ok, 
Okay, there we go. Alright, here we go again with the, uh, going from the right to the left. Maybe I should just go for that sign already, but I feel like we're gonna have to come back here for one of the hero quest items. Alright, jump back up again. Slide. Jump. Kick. Jump. Okay. It's gonna hand feed me these gems. Jump for the boombox. Get this gem, but now watch for this step. Remember what I said about it the first time. It does feel different going from the right to the left. But I am starting to get a bit of a handle on it. Awesome, only five more gems ago. And it looks like it might hand feed me these ones. Three, four, five, there we go. Just gotta get to the end now. Just gotta get to the end. Alright, we made it to the end. Okay, that scared me. But we did make it to the end. Alright. The going's getting tough, but it's not impossible. Now, yeah, like the later stages we're gonna encounter. Hopefully, that's the case. That in mind, though, I think that does it for this episode of Runner 3. As we continue our gem routes, the stages feel like they're only gonna get harder. And we actually haven't seen any hero quests yet, so who knows? Who's going to offer us these quests yet? We'll just have to wait and see. With that in mind, though, I think that's going to do it with this episode of Runner 3. So thank you guys for watching so much as I further my descent into madness. And hopefully this game does get easier. Especially because this is the gem route, but it only seems like it's going to get harder. With that in mind, though, that's my time here. So thank you so much for watching. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. The going gets tough.